ओके सो द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक दैट वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस इज टाइप्स ऑफ डिसकंटिन्यूटी तो बिफोर वी मूव फॉरवर्ड आई वुड लाइक टू टेल यू दैट इन प्रीवियस इन प्रीवियस टॉपिक्स वी हैव कवर्ड वॉट इज कंटिन्यूटी वॉट आर लिमिट्स एंड वी हैव ऑल्सो सीन वॉट डू यू मीन बाई कंटिन्यूटी सो आई जस्ट रिवाइज अ बिट दैट इफ यूर लेफ्ट हैंड लिमिट इज इक्वल टू द वैल्यू ऑफ द फंक्शन एट दैट पॉइंट एंड इट इज इक्वल टू राइट हैंड लिमिट वील से दैट ऑल द थ्री पॉइंट्स आर इक्वल एंड दे आर सो क्लोज दैट अ स्मॉल लाइन अपियर सो दैट इज वाई वेन ऑल द स्मॉल स्मॉल लाइन जॉइंड अप सो इट फॉर्म्स टू बी अ कंटिन्यूड कंटिन्यूस ग्राफ बट देयर माइट बी अ डिसकंटिन्यूटी इन दिस फॉर एग्जाम्पल एट दिस पॉइंट इट माइट बी पॉसिबल दैट देयर इज अ डिसकंटिन्यूटी एट दिस पॉइंट इट माइट बी पॉसिबल दैट देयर इज अ डिसकंटिन्यूटी एट दिस पॉइंट so it might be possible that there is a discontinuity at this point theek okay. hai but now what are the different types of discontinuity i am going to discuss about them so let us check back there are four graphs and i will be discussing about the four types of discontinuities there are four uh, graphs and i will be discussing about the four types of discontinuities i hope all the four graphs are uh, like clear to you theek okay. hai anyways now in the first graph it is visible to you that there is a straight line but a small gap at this point theek okay? hai so this is the first type of discontinuity in the second graph your function goes like this till zero and as soon as the value of x go beyond zero the value of the function becomes one this is type of electrical signal here you can see in the third case as soon as the value of x is approaching 0 the value of the function is going towards infinity similarly as soon as the value of x is approaching 0 from the positive side again the value of the function is going to infinity so it they might meet at infinity but there is no such value so they will meet at infinity so practically they will never meet So if they can never meet, so that is why it. What do you mean by this? This clearly shows that it is a sign of discontinuity. <coughs> it it is a sign of discontinuity. I'll tell you about a small rule about discontinuity. Uh, if without lifting pen you can draw the graph, it is continuous. Without lifting pen, you can draw the graph. You can draw the graph. that is clearly continuous that is clearly continuous and in the fourth case we are seeing in the fourth case we are seeing there is a patch this this white color patch i hope now it is visible to you this white color patch just behind me now in this patch you can see the function is not defined okay for example if f of x is sin 1 by x sin 1 by x then there will be a discontinuity now these there are basically four types of discontinuity so if i actually tell you about the first figure this is figure 2.20 theek okay. hai so now if we, i actually discuss about the first figure so it will be basically your function is not defined at zero so if x is equal to zero you don't know what is the value of function if x is equal to 0 you don't know the value of function if x is equal to 0 you don't know the value of function theek okay. hai you don't know the value of function so now this is just a point this is just a point where the value of function is not defined if i define the value of function at this point don't you think that this discontinuity will be removed yes if i define the function at this point the the discontinuity that we are going to discuss, that we are discussing right now it will be removed so that is why when only one point is missing we will say that it is a removable discontinuity why because we just need to define this function we just need to define this function at this particular point 
and we know we can define it that's not a very big deal if we can write f of 0 is equal to 0 if we can make the graph as f of 0 is equal to 0 automatically the graph become continuous but in second case if i say x is equal to 0 at x is equal to 0 what is the value of function you cannot tell me the value because it might be 0 it might be 0 between 0 and 1 it can be any value between 0 and 1 it can be any value between 0 and 1 if I ask you x is at x is equal to 0 what is the value of y or what is the value of u here the function is u so at sir x 0 dekh hai but after x it is 1 before x it is 0 so can you say that there is a huge discontinuity at x is equal to 0 there is a huge discontinuity at x is equal to 0 there are multiple values there are multiple values of a function at a point so that is why there might be multiple values okay so that is why that is why we will say that this is a jump discontinuity suddenly the graph jumped from one point to another so this is a jumped discontinuity and it cannot be removed because you cannot define x at x here we can say if f of 0 is equal to 0 we have defined it so the continuity is removed but here if you define f of 0 is equal to 0 still there will be continuity if you define f of 0 is equal to 1 still there will be discontinuity so jump discontinuity cannot be removed whereas in the first case that uh, the continuity the discontinuity can be removed whereas in the third case if you talk about so i just uh, go through the formal definitions if you want these slides you can get them in uh, my group uh, maths a confidence on telegram maths a confidence my uh, my approach is to boost your morale okay now it's very clear if f of x is a step function that is it is varying between 0 and 1 so before x is equal to 0 the value of the function is 0 as soon as the value of x crosses 0 the value of the function becomes 1 okay and such type of discontinuity is known as jump discontinuity in the third case where the value of the function is 1 upon x square we know that the graph goes to infinity now one very small thing i have already discussed what do you mean by infinity infinity is nothing but a very high number very high number is it clear because there is no end to number so anything which is very 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 high we term it as infinity so if you check back in this graph the graph goes to infinity and meet the graph goes to infinity and meet that's all what is written here that's all what is written here is it clear so that is why that is why in the graph of one uh, one upon x square the only reasonable limit is l tends to infinity okay at x is equal to zero l tends to infinity it cannot go on record as saying this limit exists officially it doesn't up infinity to koi limit nahi hoti hai na but we know that somewhere it will go and meet is it clear and the last type of disc uh, discontinuity is known as oscillation discontinuity so at x is equal to 0 the value of sin 1 by x the at x is equal to 0 the value of sin 1 by x is not defined so that is why we cannot put any value of y at x is equal to 0 so can we say and this this is repeated again and again this is repeated again and again as you can clearly see here it goes and then repeated and then repeated and then it goes and then it get repeated is it clear so these are the four types of discontinuities oscillatory discontinuity infinite discontinuity jump discontinuity and removable discontinuity all the four discontinuities we have studied uh chalo, let us move to the next topic so there is a new batch that is launched on 24th of november for gate 2024 and there is another batch called as Buniyad that is launched that will be launched on December 21 for gate and PSU but for 2025 now these two batches are absolutely the one of the best batches out there in the country for gate CSE preparation okay but why you should join these batches obviously legendary educators are teaching in this apart from that you will also get uh, access to 8500 plus pages per branch and along with that you will also get 5600 plus unique questions that will help you to be exam ready you will be getting the daily doubt solving classes daily practice problems i don't think this will be a big uh, like issue to you apart from that if you want to buy 
प्लस एन आइकॉनिक सब्सक्रिप्शन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू कैन यूज द कोड प्रखर टेन प्रखर टेन टू गेट अ फ्लैट टेन परसेंट डिस्काउंट एंड अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट द प्राइस फॉर ट्वेल्व मंथ ऑफ सब्सक्रिप्शन फॉर प्लस इज ट्वेंटी एट थाउजेंड एट फिफ्टी नाइन रुपीज ट्वेंटी एट थाउजेंड एट फिफ्टी नाइन रुपीज आफ्टर यू अप्लाई द कोड प्रखर टेन अदरवाइज दे आर इट इज थर्टी टू थाउजेंड आफ्टर प्राइज ड्रॉप सो अल्टीमेटली यू विल बी सेविंग अप्रॉक्सीमेटली ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड रुपीज दैट इज थर्टी परसेंट ऑफ द ओरिजिनल अमाउंट सिमिलरली इफ यू ट्राई टू गो फॉर आइकॉनिक सब्सक्रिप्शन यू विल बी सेविंग अप्रॉक्सीमेटली ट्वेंटी सिक्स परसेंट तो गो नाउ ऑन अकेडमी प्लेटफॉर्म यूज द कोड प्रखर टेन एंड गेट योर सेल्फ अ टेन परसेंट डिस्काउंट एंड don't uh, like these are the recorded lecture prizes that i have already discussed and if you are not enrolled for not enrolled for all india mock test then go get yourself enrolled because you can get 100% scholarship in this so someone who is securing rank between 1 to 10 will be getting 100% scholarship rank 11 to 60 will be 75% rank 61 to 200 will be 50% and if you are under 500 you will be getting a discount and it will also help you to realize that how a gate paper looks like what you feel while giving the paper so what are you waiting for get yourself exam ready and get yourself some of the discount offer that are going on so when you are having these tests these tests will be there on 4th of december 18th of december 8th of january 15th of january 22nd january and 29th january and you can register absolutely free using the code prakhar 20 prakhar 10 ठीक है तो आई डोंट थिंक यू विल बी हैविंग एनी डाउट थैंक यू